Tallulah and this is my vlog. Yes, darling, don't adjust your screen. Although you may need, I think Holster is becoming a camera in which she's having to take a serious up and down shot as we speak. That is the extent of my feathered headband. Yes, there's even the Mad Hatter. The Mad Hatter on my feathered headband. Bonjour, Lulu. Arr, arr, arr. Welcome to the vlog. Now, today we are talking about networking and how to be better at it. Networking, I think, is one of those things a little like public speaking that fills people with general amount of dread. Not to worry, not to worry. At ease, soldier, I have the solution on my head. Wear something extraordinary. Thus providing a topic of conversation for anyone else in the room. Thus saving yourself humiliation. And also, the thing to remember about networking, Oftentimes one can think, oh, I'm worried and I don't know how to do it. But actually, everyone else is equally as worried and not sure how to do it. So by wearing something dramatic, like a nice hat or a nice necklace or something, you're actually providing a service, allowing them to think of something to say to you. You know, so it's twofold. So I say, wear something magnificent, that will break the ice. Now, what I'm about to say has come from a source who used to work with President Clinton, who I've never been in a room with him yet, but I have heard that he is very charismatic and amazing dealing with big rooms of people and such. And this person said that he is phenomenal because he faces people front on, okay? So you're standing there, somebody's having a canopy, you're having a canopy, you're not halfway, you're not a little bit shifty, snake-like, no, you're 100% square on with that person, darling, and then you do 70% of the listening and only 30% of the talking. You spend on average between four and five minutes face on with that person. And then right before you pop off to get another canopy, you just re repeat a little bit of what they said to you. So imagine somebody's telling you that they're going to go to Tunisia on holiday. They're going to read books and have their pedicure done on their toes red because they love that. And then, so they're maybe saying a myriad of other things, but right before you pop off, you say, enjoy your red toed holiday in Tunisia. And then you pop off. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how to network in a nutshell. Wear something wonderful and then listen more than you talk. And that will say, also, ask people lots of questions. In general, people love talking about themselves. I mean, not me, I include in, oh, gosh, I'm knocking things, I'm so excited. I'm knocking over my, this is my little, it's, it's shimmer spray. This is another good thing to put on before you go out, darling. Make sure you're shimmering up to the nines. Now, what to eat before you go out. I would say don't eat much because you may want a canopy and you don't want to be over full. But the sandwich of the week isn't a sandwich actually, darling, I'm going a little off book. This is going to be a bag of nuts. Brazil nuts in particular have selenium, thought solarium, no I think it's selenium, and that is very good for confidence and you want to feel as confident as you can before you go out. That's why I also suggest putting on your favourite music, just to put you in the mood as you get your feathered headdress and yourself ready. And there we go, darling, network up a storm, a bon appétit.